34-year-old Abalash Baskaran, a director of software development for a large computer company. He thinks he's here to meet a 13-year-old girl. Hey, come on in. Just fine, how are you? Come on. I'm just finishing up some laundry. Take it back. I made you some sweet tea if you want to pour a glass. His screen name is Raj21US21. While chatting online with a decoy pretending to be 13, he asks, Hun, would you like to take me in your mouth? The girl says, I'm not sure how. So Raj21US21 says, we will learn as we go along. But just as they're about to sign off, he tells the decoy what he's doing is wrong, that he has to be cautious. Cautious? Why? Fake copies and scripted you know, winners, copies and force and if you said me? no further links, so I well, I don't sure give a shit. Okay. Uh, sorry, I did not catch that. Copies and scripted, huh? I don't want to see a cop waiting to see me there. <laughs> he seems Hello. relieved when he sees our decoy and not a police officer. <laughs> Sit down, make yourself at home. Sure, thank you. I'm just getting these out so I don't get wrinkled. All right. So you've got a big afternoon planned, huh? Oh, oh uh, why don't you have a seat right there, please? What's going on? Nothing much. I thought I'll just make a friend and that's it. Told just to make a friend? Yeah. And who is the friend you were here to see? Um, some, uh, Amy. Amy. Right. And, and how old is Amy? She said she was 13. 13? Yeah. And how old are you? 34. 34. And why did you think it was okay at the age of 34 to come visit a 13-year-old girl home alone? I said, I mean, it is for sex I am not coming. For sex you are not coming? Yeah. So I'll just make a good friend. Um, so I'm educated. I have an MBA. You have an MBA? Yeah. You know, I'm married and, you know, the marriage is not going well, so... I'm sorry, you're married? Yeah, yes, I am. And, and the marriage is not going well? Yeah, it? so I you know, just wanted a friend to talk to, kind of. But explain to me how difficulty in your marriage led you to this house where you believed a 13-year-old girl was home alone? No, he said he's, you know, she's, she's uh, uh, good in studies and... Good in studies. And I thought it is like a mature friend, I mean... Okay, a I mature guess. friend? Yeah. Where were you when you were having this chat with this 13-year-old girl, Amy? Were you at I, your... I was in office. You were in your office? Yeah. Now, does your boss know that you are online chatting with 13-year-old girls? I'm sure they don't. So what would his bosses think Talk if they read a transcript of his pornographic online chat? You ask if she masturbates. Right. You say, I feel like kissing you now. Right. And suck on your blank and feel the tummy. Right. Um, that is the first day. Then I, you know, slept on that and realized it is not a good thing. I mean, you know, it is it's not something which I should do. Well, why even come over here? No, I mean, it's, you know, just like working for one year, I thought, just thought I would just take a day off and... Uh, so you took a day off to come over here? Yeah. So you told them you had something else to do? Oh, uh, who? The people at your office. Yeah, yes. Oh. I love you so much, hon. You talk about being cautious. I know. She says, why? You say, you know, sex with a minor is called rape. Right, I understand. I'm so you know the law. Yeah, I understand the law. Well, Javi... There's a, there's a couple things you need to know. Yeah. I'm Chris Hansen with Dateline NBC. We're doing a story on adults who meet teens online. Nothing else to say. Okay. Thank you. Since he's never seen one of our reports, he doesn't know that law enforcement is waiting outside to arrest him. Get on the ground. On the ground now. Get down. When he's taken in for questioning, he asks to speak to a lawyer. I'm a foreign national. Um, can I get an attorney or something? All right. What happens next, sir? Now you go to jail. Once at the jailhouse, he's fingerprinted and photographed. My wife and kids won't know where I am, so you can call and let them know. I'll get back with you on that in just a little bit. Then put behind bars, awaiting a hearing. Well, you're charged with criminal attempt child molestation. That's a felony. It carries a penalty of 1 to 20 years. He seems awfully calm, though, about the situation. He's like... Fuck yeah, no, no further wife, your honor. I think he's like, not completely devastated. Or at least it didn't look like that, or some shit.